congratulations on your new three and a half year contract. What does it mean to stay at Wrexham, your boyhood club? Yeah, it means a lot for, for me, um, especially my family. Um, obviously, I've been through a little bit of a tough time, but finally some good news and, and hopefully like a light at the end of the tunnel, in a way. Obviously, you came back to Wrexham from Brighton. A lot of people expect you might be able to play at a higher level. Why have you chosen to stay at Wrexham? I think the project here is amazing and the opportunity and what can come what can come from this this in terms of the potential growth of the club I think it's, it's too much to turn down and what do you think Wrexham can achieve over the next three and a half years um, I think we can definitely get out of this league I think league two is then easier to get out of than this league so I can see us being in league one by two three four years time so your ambitions were matched by what the club had told you and what you did, what you'd want as a player is what you expected from the team. Yeah, I think from myself and the club's point of view, we were on a similar page from the get go. Um, it just had to be come terms agreed, and and we were both looking up, and I can't wait to try and get the club there. So you signed your deal on New Year's Eve after a year in which you scored seventeen goals for Wrexham. It took until March for your first goal, but I mean, just how has it been for you since then? Yeah, I think, like you said, it took a long time to come, but since March, I think I've really kicked on, and I think everyone around the club's noticed that within me as well. Um, and I think from March, it's been it's been a pretty successful year, if I'm honest for myself. Um, 17 goals, if you'd have told me that going into February of last year, then I'd have laughed at you most probably, but here we are with 17 goals later. How have you found it playing for Wrexham? Obviously, breaking into men's football for the first time while you were here. Yeah, um, it took a while to get used to it, like I've said uh, previously, but once I found my feet, I think I've gone from one one step and just kept going and not look, look, not look back, really. Obviously, we had to wait till August for it, but what's it meant to you to play in front of the Wrexham supporters, having grown up as a local lad? Yeah, I think to all the lads, it means a lot of support this year, but when it comes to me, it's different. It, it, it hits harder when we win. It hits harder when we lose, so it's really really good but also it can be tough but hopefully there won't be as many tough tough times and lots of good times if that makes sense you signed a long term deal now what are your targets are you taking it bit by bit or have you got a longer target for those three and a half years get the club promoted I think it's my first target um, personally and for the club to, to get a promotion would, would mean so much um, and I've not really looked past this season at the minute if I'm honest because I'm concentrated on this season and, and getting us promoted. In terms of individual accolades, you mentioned those goals, getting assists as well. Do you set individual targets? Yeah, um, me and my agent sit down at the start of the season and we go through what what we think would deliver a successful season and this season I'm on, I'm on target and, and I'm hitting target so I'm happy. Finally, as it's New Year's Eve, so a chance to reflect on the past year. What would you say to the Wrexham supporters both looking back and looking forward now? Um, I think from the start of the season to where we are now, we're in a much better place. Um, still believe the hype and I think, thank you very much for the support. I think every time we've been even to away games, it's been, you always think how many are going to turn up, but there's always more than what you think and they've delivered in their numbers this year and long may continue. Brilliant. Thanks so much, Sean. Congratulations.